myself dr umesh garu assistant professor bn eagles college in jaipur i am here to deliver a lecture on the topic is defined on the blackboard that is the micro evolution the micro evolution is the evolutionary process which from that is that the one gene can be converted into the broad and the micro the on the very broad level in the evolution process like from generation first to the next generation during the evolution first of all i want to introduce from the definition of the micro evolution the micro evolution means is the one gene how is a one gene can be converted into the broad gene from to the phylum to the phylum like from to the euro the codates from to the the mammals <coughs> in the four example like in the crops the crops when we originate in the uh, one field area that is the single gene will be found that that is for the healthy crops for the future resistance <coughs> next in the example in the favor of the micro evolution there is a first example of the size of the sparrow the size of the sparrow in the north america in the larger than and the comparatively the sparrow found in the south america <coughs> the sparrow found in the north america is that the the warmly adapted and and are not easily adapted in the coolest area of the north america but the sparrow which is found in the south america which has very well adapted in the in, in the warmer in the warmer places in comparatively to the cool places in the se second example of the bacterial resistance it means the how the bacteria can be resistant to their the resistance against of their the defense mechanism which are capable to survive for their long time period in the evolution the bacterial resistant like the malaria the malaria is evolving their persistence to resist for their well developed life for against to the ddt same as the hiv is evolving their defense against the the antibacterial virals and the medicines <coughs> the same example found of the micro evolution and the many bacterial species like the aids and the hiv and um, and the many microorganisms which are involved to produce are the petrol and the and the crops also <coughs> so then when the micro evolution in path is a very generally and first evolving that is converted into the micro evolution it means that is the basic of the micro evolution when it goes on to the broad area that means the micro evolution convert into the micro evolution it means at last that micro evolution is a short time period of the it is a very short time period study of the evolution it means a we can be study of the micro evolution at genes from one generation to next generation we can't be study on the broad level in a evolution but we can be easily study from in a short time period from the one generation to the next generation it means that is the micro evolution and when the micro evolution convert into the broad range of from the the first generation to the seventh and eighth generation it it means it is convert into the macro evolution Thank you, thank you, and thank you. For more detail, please log on guru kpo dot com.